We're solving problem 10 from the 2024 F equals MA exam. A block of mass M is connected to the walls of a frictionless block by two massless springs with relaxed lengths L and 2L and spring cost constants K and 2K respectively. The length of the box is 3L. The system rotates with a constant angular velocity W about one of its walls. And uh, here we have um, all of these uh, forces here. This omega is the yeah, angular velocity. And uh, suppose the block stays a constant distance r from the axis of rotation without touching either of the walls. What is the value of r? So we have this uh, big distance from, we have this <coughs> big distance r uh, from the edge to the middle of the box. And we have the length of the spring, and we have the small x here. Um, well, first things first, we can balance forces on each other, and the force on this side would be the formula for the angular velocity m omega squared times r, and these are all just the spring constants times our small distance x over here. So we say that k times x plus 2kx uh, equals m omega squared times r. Since we know that x is equal to our length r, uh, I should do this lowercase, r minus l, uh, we can, that l is not too good. L, uh, we can plug this in our equation. So this becomes 3k times r minus L equals, yeah, m omega squared times r. Uh, so now that we have this, well, we can see something right here. Well, what we can really rewrite it is, uh, we want the same variables on each side, right? So if we multiply this out, we get 3kr minus 3kl. So uh, 3kr. We have to subtract this other side. Um, we, we just want the l out of this 3k times l. And, well, what is this? This is going to be... We have an R now, this is good. We have an omega. And well, what is the mass? Well, there are two massless springs. Uh, uh, should probably write it like this. This is still M. M. Uh, M omega squared times r uh, equals 3k l. So if you factor out an r, uh, this becomes r times 3k minus m omega squared is equal to 3k l. So therefore, solving for r, we uh, divide both sides by this. We get that R is equal to our answer of 3KL over 3K minus M omega squared, uh, which on the test is answer choice D.